everyone. Adolf brings you the next episode of our super cool interview series. And today we have none other than a lovely Viraj with us. Hello Viraj, how are you today? I'm fine mom. Great, good to meet you. So for the benefit of our viewers, can you tell us your full name and how old you are? My name is Viraj Singh and, I, and I'm 8 years old. 8 years old. Okay, very well Viraj. So now let's move on to the first interesting question I have for you today. When you wake up every day, is there anything that makes you happy? Uh, eating first drink milk. You like drinking milk? Yeah. Oh, so what about plain milk? Do you like plain milk or you love Horlicks or Bon Vita? or some chocolate syrup in it. Mom, Don't I don't eat anything. I drink plain milk. Plain milk. Okay. Clearly, clearly, clearly I see your love for milk. I can never have plain milk. I always need either Bon Vita or some chocolate syrup in it. But good for you. So that brings me to my next question, Viraj. Now, this one is again about food. So tell me, if you could only eat one thing for an entire week, okay, all three times of the day, what are you going to choose? Any one food item. Chocolate. Chocolate? Okay. Do you mean a, a different packed chocolates that we get? Amul chocolate, dairy milk chocolates? And can you have them all three times of the day? Remember, you're not going to eat anything else. No, I can't have it, but I can have a subway. A subway? Yes. Ah, so you can have subway for one entire week. I think I'll agree with you on that. It's quite healthy and quite yummy, isn't it? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> all right. Now, I have a pretend question for you. Now here Viraj, I want you to pretend like you are a photographer for a day. Okay, so what are you going to photograph? If I was a photographer for a day, I'll photograph some, some uh, the, a wedding with the people who are dancing very well, the dancers, the food, and some crackers saying happy wedding, the cuttings of the cake of the wife and the husband and the, the swimming pools over there, okay. cupcakes, subway and many more things. Okay, so you are choosing a wedding to photograph and I can see so many things in that wedding you want to photograph from the food to the celebrations to the bride and the groom everything do you think it's it's very festive is that why you selected a wedding i want to keep pictures of a wedding because i saw many things like some cupcakes cakes the groom and wife cutting the cake swimming pools and some firecrackers and a lot of amazing things so you saw all of this in a wedding that you attended yes okay all right so that's what inspired you very well very well so now viraj i'm moving on to our next question now imagine if you stepped out of this interview and you found out that you have won 1 crore rupees. Now that's a lot of money. What would you do with all that money? Um, with my money, I will um, buy some things like I'll buy a gaming card. Then I will keep it carefully with me and play a lot of games until it is finished. Okay. Then I will love to to go to the food courts near the gaming center and I'll just buy some ice cream and pizza to eat for myself then I will go on a train which is only for kids and I'll also learn new things in the mall and buy a new iPhone <laughs> Alright Virat, so now let's move on to our next question Now tell me this, 
is there anything that really annoys you because you seem to be a really calm and joyful boy but is there no. anything that annoys you nothing that annoys me except one thing okay when someone teases me a lot when someone teases you i think that's a fair thing to be annoyed yeah yes. so what do you do when someone teases you i start interrupting him when he is so so viraj is there any memory or anything that you like to do with your parents any of your favorite yeah. activities um i like to play with my father and mother games like watching tv having fun playing carrom going on outings okay so you like to go with them to the mall do they allow you to get your game card yes <laughs> all right all right very well viraj so now let's move on to my next question now this is another interesting question that i have for you all right so viraj imagine if you could make any three rules for yourself in the house well not just for yourself for everyone in your house for your mom and your dad and everyone has to follow those rules so what are those three rules going to be the three rules for my house are um share your things with everyone do not fight for things cook your food together try to share your house your work wow well these are four rules but i think very important rules all four of them yeah share your things don't fight cook together i think that's very important yeah it's not just one person's responsibility all of you can cook together have fun make some very nice dishes yeah <laughs> very well viraj very well yeah maybe make some subway uh sandwiches in the house my mother makes um sandwiches with her maid Okay so your mama likes to make it in the house very well and do you help her at times um yes ma'am sometimes i'm really busy and sleeping okay sometimes when you're not busy not sleeping that's when you help your mama yes ma'am <laughs> all right viraj very well so now we are coming on to the last question of your interview today so tell me this Is there something that you can do today that you couldn't do last year? Last year I was not able to sit a lot but now I I can sit as much as, as I want. So last year you couldn't sit for a long time why is that? Because you couldn't focus? Yes ma'am. Oh, okay. But now you can sit for long hours. Yes ma'am. I think the credit goes to online classes, doesn't it? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> okay, Viraj. Okay, all right. But you know, it's equally important to get up, go out, and play. So, do you play as well along with your classes? Yes. Okay. So then you have a good balance. So I had quite an interesting interview here with you. Did you enjoy our conversation? Yes, ma'am. Very well. More power to you, Viraj, and you take care. And we'll hopefully see you around. Bye. Bye. Bye from a doll to everyone. Yay!